the Kasob composition adjustment by sealed argon bubbling with oxygen blowing process was developed in the 1980s by Nippon Steel Corporation. The objective of the Kasob process is to homogenize and control the steel composition and temperature. The process is commonly divided into heat up, alloying and reduction of slag. The objective of the heat up stage is to increase the temperature of the steel bath by chemical heating, which is conducted by feeding aluminium particles into the melt and employing simultaneous oxygen blowing through a top lance. In practice, the rate of chemical heating is limited in order to avoid introducing excessive thermal stresses to the wall structures by means of heat transfer processes, particularly radiation and convection. The main feature of the process is the refractory bell underneath which alloy additions to the bath is made. The steel ladle is positioned such that the bell is situated right above the porous stirring plug. This ensures that the agitated surface of the steel bath is confined to the area underneath the belt. Bottom bubbling gas creates an open eye in the slag layer. The belt is lured onto the liquid steel over this open eye in the slag. In particular, it allows the simultaneous addition of aluminium and blowing of oxygen gas through a top lens. Due to the heat generated by the reaction of aluminium and oxygen, the liquid steel temperature can be raised by up to 10 degrees per minute. The aluminium oxide form needs to float out to produce clean steel. Additional argon stirring, if necessary, is achieved through a specially shaped submerged lance. Further addition of ferroalloys into the slag-free region achieves higher yield. After the delivery of the ladle to the liquid steel processing station, blowing of argon through the porous plug in the bottom of the ladle is started and presence of purging can be visually monitored. Before the bell is lowered, argon flow is increased so that the surface of the liquid steel in the purge has the open eye. The lower end of the bell is immersed into the liquid steel in the area of the open eye by at least 200 millimeters. After having lowered the bell in the liquid steel to the desired depth, the flow of argon is reduced. Also, the temperature of the liquid steel and the activity of dissolved oxygen in it are measured. The free surface of the liquid steel from the slag inside the bell serves the place for addition of granular aluminium and other additives for deoxidation. After this, homogenization is carried out of the liquid steel for about 4 to 5 minutes. Then argon flow is reduced further for taking a sample and measuring the temperature of the liquid steel. The result of temperature measurement is calculated for chemical heating, the required amount of aluminium metal and oxygen.